Well, as Danny just mentioned, the threat of winter weather has the city of Memphis and MLGW on high alert. ABC 24 Zaria Oates continues our team coverage from downtown Memphis, where a news conference wrapped a short while ago. Zaria, what were the key takeaways of that update? Kevin, the biggest takeaway right now is that it is time to prepare, not time to panic. It is very cold. It is very windy outside right now. MLGW and the city's Public Works Division wants everyone to make sure that you're stocked on food, stocked on water, and making sure that you're staying off the road as best as you can once that winter precipitation begins. Now, MLGW President Doug McGowan said that he does not believe that there will be another need to go through those rolling blackouts that we went through that was ordered by TVA during the last Arctic blast back in December of 2022. McGowan said there still could be an energy conservation alert. This is a voluntary option to cut back how much electricity you're using to prevent any issues from a higher electricity demand during those cold days ahead. Shutting off as many lights as possible, turning off and unplugging electric space heaters, avoiding using large appliances like your dishwasher, your washer, your dryer, and avoiding running other non-critical electric uses. And we would ask that you do that during the period of the alert. Now, President McGowan isn't expecting this alert to take place until Tuesday, but there is that possibility. So make sure that you're aware that that is an option. It is voluntary. Tomorrow morning, Saturday, the city's Public Works Division will head out and be salting and brining the roads to make sure that they're as safe as possible in these conditions to drive on. And there will be another meeting from the city to give an update on the conditions on Monday. We'll keep you updated here and online at abc24.com. Live in downtown Memphis, I'm Zaria Oates.